in Ceylon. Earlier today, Cantor spoke with CNN's Christian Amanpour to further explain his position. NBA made me do this because every time when one of the NBA teams or one of the or, or the commissioner came out and speak, they say we are encouraging our players to talk about whatever they want to talk about. We are giving the freedom to our players to talk about all the injustices happening around the world, all the you know human rights abuses around the world. So they give me this right. They told me to do this basically. But the other thing is obviously I, I sit down with. Uh, you know, people from the NBA, and I even sit down with Adam Silver and had a, a conversation, and I told him, Adam, listen, am I breaking any rules? Because if I'm breaking any rules, please tell me I'll be the first one to follow every NBA rule, because NBA give me what I have, and I don't want to break any kind of rules that you guys have put on. He said, no, you're not breaking any rules. Well, I told him, is, is the NBA against China? is NBA and Adam Silver and the, all the organizations, you know, the, all the teams and owners, are, are they supporting NS Cantor? They're, he told me, yes, we are supporting you against China. So that is one. The second thing is, you know, I don't know how much that is true. Because, you know, if they were, if they were really supporting me, they would have put something out there. They would have said, you know, they would have put like some kind of statement or they would have they put some kind of like, because... I told Adam this too, our team games, you know, the Boston Celtics games are banned in China. And this is unacceptable just because of, I talk about the human rights violations that are happening over there. People think I, I do politics. I don't do politics. Okay. I do human rights. All right. All right. So, you, I just want to make sure you're not saying the NBA gave you the green light to say this stuff. You're just saying that their rules are that freedom of expression is an American right? Or, or are you saying they specifically exactly. gave you the green light? Exactly. So not specifically, but just the general commitment to freedom of speech, right? Right, yes. There is so many athletes, so many actors, so many singers, and so many people who has a platform are speaking out many of the issues out there in the world. But when it comes to China, when it comes to, you know, China's Communist uh, Party, they're scared because they care too much about money, they care too much about business, and they care, they care too much about endorsement deals. You know, to me, uh, the human rights and, you know, saving people's lives it comes, comes first. So that's why um, I wanted to do this uh, project. Well, that was just a small excerpt from a really thought-provoking interview.